but it's not, it's, not, it's not gripping. But if I said to you, hey, how was that pizza? And you were like, it was great. You see the difference there? Like that, that gives that, that this pizza that you had had a uniqueness to it, right? And I'm convinced that when we understand that something is great, it's attractive. That's why God presents himself as being great. It is attractive, my friends. That's why I think our, when we talk about the good news of Jesus, I'd rather just say it's the great news of Jesus because it cannot be compared to. I think that greatness is, is something that we need to use that is something that it, when it cannot be compared to. I'll tell you why I know this to be true, okay? For one reason and one reason only. Because the only reason why anyone eats frosted flakes is for one reason, only reason why five-year-old children bug their mother for one reason, okay, is because somebody with a genius mind said, let's put the word, they're great, right there with Tony the Tiger, who's six foot four, all right, and just says, they're great. And all the kids, including myself, okay, get hyped up believing that this cheap cornflakes with frosted sugar on it is great. And anything that compares to it doesn't match up. All my Frosted Flakes cereal brothers and sisters said amen. amen. I know you had a box of cereal this morning. Yeah, but seriously, when you think about it, that's the only reason why anyone, why? Because it's, they're great and they presented it and put it in your mind. There's nothing that compares to Frosted Flakes. Even the, you know, those, that cheap brand that tries to compare. You, you don't buy it. You're like, no, 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 no. I only buy Frosted Flakes because they're great. They're the best. No one compares and so, my friend, I'm telling you, that's why God presents himself as great. And that's why I'm telling you, the good news of Jesus is great news for mankind. And every soul, every person who has breath has the right to hear the gospel of Jesus Christ. That is why on Family Fun Night, we are preaching the gospel three times. Like we're